So let's talk about labor. The first part of labor is what we call early labor, and that's when you're dilating slowly at first, usually to about four centimeters is what I would define early labor. Now the thing about early labor is it takes for most people the greatest amount of time. It can take days to get from closed up to four centimeters. After that though, things progress pretty quickly, at least a centimeter an hour and many times much quicker than that. So don't get discouraged if you've been in the hospital for 10 hours and you've only dilated one or two centimeters. That's totally normal. Now in early labor, it may feel terrible to you, but the best is yet to come. So this really, the contractions are strong, but they're not as painful as they're going to be once you really get into active labor. Um, and this is a time when many times people will want to walk around. Uh, and so what we'll do is we'll monitor the baby for an amount of time, make sure the baby's okay, and then we let you get up and sort of wander around the hospital, um, sometimes with your IV pole or with your hospital gown, and walk around. And, and walking can sometimes really help sort of work through some of the pain of the contractions and some people think that the gravity of being up helps bring the baby's head down. Whether that's true or not is, is hard to say, um, but it certainly for many people feels good. This would also be the time, if you're interested, where you can use like a jacuzzi tub. So our hospital and many hospitals have a jacuzzi tub that you can soak in um, during early labor. You know, it helps give you sort of a back massage, loosen up your muscles and makes you feel better. So those are the kind of things that happen during early labor. Now what you'll notice is that we'll want the baby on the monitor for a certain amount of time and then we'll let you off the monitor for a certain amount of time and then recheck the baby periodically just to make sure that there aren't any problems. MedTwice.com